hi guys welcome to my channel i hope you're doing well so this reading will be for you if you have sagittarius as your sun moon venus rising north node or if you are dealing with a person who has sagittarius placement okay guys please bear in mind these are general readings so it may or may not resonate okay so if you know your birth chart check your other placements if it doesn't but um definitely watch the end okay guys because that's when you get the full story all right see sagittarius we have oh oh we have love we have somebody asking you out on a date somebody um getting you gifts two of cups so we have uh pisces cancer scorpio here both cards Are you dating sagittarius Are you thinking about dating Are you ready to date again let's see that's nice really nice please tell me more about Sagittarius I've never had the cards like that before like Knight of Cups and then the Two of Cups that's really nice oh did I speak too soon okay so Two of Pentacles we have um, Taurus Virgo Capricorn and we have the Seven of Swords Libra Energy so I'm getting um some of you guys are like, hmm, okay, there's something about this person I like, you know, they're, they're saying some of the right things, they're doing some of the right things, but am I the only person, am I the only one that's, you know, is there something they're hiding from me, okay, so this is, see, this is either your thoughts, some of you guys are quite guarded and you're just thinking, mm, am I the only person they're talking to, are they juggling, are they doing something behind my back, are they lying, are they cheating, like, are they not being, like, straight up with me? What What's going on? So we have the star, we have Aquarius. King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. The Chariot, Cancer. I mean... Okay, so this person could either be watching an Aquarius or they see... They see um, potential. They definitely see potential. Okay, I can see why you guys are confused. Because that just confused me. They're either watching... Some of you guys feel like there's someone else in their energy. But they're showing you that there's potential in your relationship, in your connection. This could either be something that's on and off or quite new. Um, King of Cups, a chariot. Okay. Let me just get one more card before, yeah, yeah, okay. So for some of you, you feel like this person's gone to see someone else or visiting someone else, dealing with someone else, and it's making you feel like, mm, I, like, I thought this was going well, but with the five of wands now, because I, mm, I was thinking, where's the chariot? Where are they going? Where are they going? And it's like some kind of competition here. This, I feel like this person is making you feel insecure about the connection. And if it's new, if it's new, you're like, I don't know about this. Three of Swords. The Seven of the Seven of Swords and the Three of Swords underneath. So some of you guys may have found out something that it, um, somebody that you've been dealing with um is is has another person don't know if it's past or like past or new um oh all right so i'm getting that this person is this, this is a past person guys so this person from their past has broke their heart and this person is trying to move on. They still have they still have some kind of connection with this past person. Um, this past person could have cheated on them or just broke their heart. Okay, they did something behind their back that made them feel heartbroken, okay? And they're trying to move on, but I feel like they, they want to move on, but there's something that's still keeping this person attached. And I feel like they have 
I feel like they have either seen each other or spoken to each other. This person said, are you seeing someone else? And they're saying, no, ten of wands is becoming a burden. It's like, uh, yeah, this person, this per this sister, if they live together, I feel like it was um quite stressful. Your person may tell you this. It become a burden, like it it was too much. They had to leave. They had to go. I'm getting a very toxic energy now. Page of Swords. Yeah, there you go. Page of Swords. So it's like somebody could not trust the other person. There was no trust in this relationship. They were spying on each other constantly, accusing each other of things. Yeah, they ah, oh, there we go. Six of Pentacles. Five of Pentacles. So someone feels like they they were so, um someone your person or them felt like they were giving someone else okay and someone was like hold on what is going on because I'm I, I I'm left in the dark like I don't understand that like, you're not this is why the connection ended with them it's not the kind of reason that okay okay oh this turned around as well. The Eight of Pentacles. So this could have happened. This could have happened at work. Um, somebody was at work. Somebody was at work. Either your person or or their or the, their ex person. Their ex was at work, and there's someone else used to go off and see somebody else while they were at work. Could have been some or somebody was dealing with somebody from work oh <laughs> okay so I, the page of swords are full of ones i'm getting that somebody was like checking to see when the person's coming home or like you know what time are you coming home what time are you are you gonna be home early today are you are you, gonna, are you doing overtime are you going out to see your friends afterward be because they were doing something sneaky I don't like this. Does does this person you're dealing with have true intentions with you? Page of Cups. Yeah, but I I feel like they 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 like the attention, they like the conversation and stuff. But let me see, what's here? Four of Swords in reverse, Knight of Pentacles in reverse. So this person's they feel like they're ready to, um, because, you know, four of swords are upright. Yeah, that's taking a break. So I feel like this person's kind of like done with the break period, like either with dating or with the ex-person, ready to move on. Um, for some of you guys, this person is low on money because um, they may have lost a job recently or something to do with their home life. They may have had to like pay a lot of money towards getting a new home. Um, like a deposit and stuff like that so they may be low on funds right now or just being very careful with their money mm. is this person is this person a genuine person like they do they have pure intentions for Sagittarius six of swords ace of swords King of Swords. So they might be a bit cold because of what they went through. That's all Swords energies. So like you could be dealing with an air sign, uh, Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. All, all Swords have come out here, but I feel like this person will tell you the truth, but I feel like whatever the truth is, they're quite cold with it. And you're like, hmm, it might be quite straightforward and to the point where you're like, do you even care about what happened? But I feel like they're just pissed off at the situation. Guys, let me know if that resonates because or who it resonates with anyways i'm gonna leave it there guys please like share subscribe and i'll see you in the next reading bye guys